Vietnam kidnap victim Trinh Duan Than appears on TV. A former oil executive who Germany accuses Vietnam of kidnapping after he applied for asylum in Berlin has appeared on Vietnamese state TV. Trinh Duan Than said he had turned himself into the Vietnamese authorities after returning there. The German Foreign Ministry said he had been abducted in an unprecedented breach of German and international law. Mr. Than is accused of causing $150 million, 114 million pounds, in losses at state oil firm Petro Vietnam. I wasn't thinking maturely and decided to hide, and during that time I realized I need to return to face the truth and admit my faults and apologize, Mr. Than, 51, said during his appearance on Vietnam television. In what was termed a signed confession dated 31 July, the state broadcaster quoted him as saying, Because of fear I decided to hide in Germany, where I lived a precarious and anxious life. I returned to Vietnam and presented myself at the investigative authority. Germany has ordered a Vietnamese intelligence officer to leave Germany, and demanded that Mr. Than should be allowed to return to Germany. Mr. Than's lawyer, Petrisch Lagenhoff, condemned the Vietnamese authorities. This is a forced confession. He was kidnapped. We know it, the German police know it, the German government knows it, she told BBC Vietnamese in an email. I fear for the health of my client. He looks very bad. It is unclear if Mr. Than has legal representation in Vietnam. Trials on camera are common in Vietnam. Dissent in the one-party state is not tolerated, but despite that, activists have publicly criticized the government amid the kidnapping allegations. A Vietnamese foreign ministry spokeswoman said earlier that she felt great pity about the German government's stance. Vietnam very much respects and wants to develop the strategic partnership relation between Vietnam and Germany, she added.